In this video, I am going to show you how to track HubSpot live chatbot for GA4 and using Google Tag Manager. Hi, you are welcome to this video. My name is Nasim and I am a top rated freelancer on Upwork, especially on conversion tracking. If you have any issue to set up your conversion tracking, feel free to contact me. Details on the video description. Let's back to this topic. As you can see, this is my demo website and I have embedded the HubSpot chat with my website. So now it's look like this. So now I am going to see how many people actually are visiting my website and uh, use this chat bot. So that's why I need to use Google Tag Manager. And you can see my website is connected with Google Tag Manager. If you don't know how to uh, connect Google Tag Manager, simply cop click here and copy this code and paste it in your know, website. I hope you can do that. And you can uh, see and also my website is connected uh, through the analytics. So you can see here is the configuration tag I have connected ga4 with my website now i need to set up the um, event which is uh, hubspot meeting so first of all i have to go on the preview mode and see i'm going to on the preview mode and this is actually my website uh, your website should be different so i'm opening this uh, website on the preview mode and here you can see my PV mode debug view is connected and here it is uh, you can see this is my chatbot so you can see here is no extra or custom event I got so if I click on this button uh, actually here is also not need so I need to add new chat so it's actually i tested so that's why it's look like this so if i want to start new chat click on this right button and input any message hi you can see uh, if i go back on the hub uh, tag manager you can see here is the new event is coming which is conversion we gain so actually this is my uh, conversion uh, actually this is my trigger that i want to uh, see the event when uh, this trigger is fired so that's why uh, i got my trigger now i need to set up the event so for this case i am going to copy it and go to tag manager and click on new and then click on ga4 event and i will use uh, the configuration base code and what the na event name uh, you need to uh, see in your analytics dashboard you uh, you can uh, choose any custom name here so i want to choose uh, uh, chat start so i want to keep this name a uh, chat name but uh, you can also change uh, this name you can uh, choose whatever you want it's nothing important uh, so actually you uh, should follow the uh, ga4 instruction you all are small uh, later and uh, you need to the back it's lost so this kind of format you should use and uh, i will make a trigger now which will be the custom event and i will use this exact same name and i will uh, keep the same name and save it so i need to save this trigger ga4 live set so and i am saving it so my tag is done now it's time to test so first of all i am going to preview again and then i want to go the analytics debug view also because it's make sure for i'm getting the exact same event so for if i want to click on debug view it's actually the live uh, preview that i'm getting the information here and you can see my website is connected with this uh, 
event so i want to close it and i didn't start new chat yet so that's why it's fired not fired so if i click on new event and input any message here hello you can see my tag is fired it's actually the another tag for type from uh, if you saw my uh, very last video you will uh, learn how to uh, track submit uh, type from so you can see uh, my uh, tag is fired so if i go back the analytics uh, i should see that yes the set start now so now i need to make a conversion so if you want to make conversion you should go on conversion and uh, you should make the you should keep the exact same name so uh, like you can copy it from here so if i want to open it and copy it from here and input it here and save it so this is actually the process uh, you can make the uh, conversion so if i uh, go on the preview mode again and start the new chat then it should be the conversion setup okay so in this setup i didn't use any parameter so that's why i don't uh, need to extra hassle so that's why uh, okay let's check the conversion is working or not so i need to click on new and set hi and if i go back here my tag is fired and if i go the debug view again and select google and wait for the new con yes here it is the conversion is here so that's mean this is working fine that's all for today if you found this video was useful for you don't forget to give thumbs up and if you want to see more video from me then hit the subscribe button i will see you on the next video till then bye have a good day